Good evening everyone. Welcome to another episode of the Avocado Insider series. It's your host Harshit Goda. And in this episode we continue our discussion with Dr. Robert O'Nathan and we talk about the root stocks which are the most suitable for firstly the arid and the semi-arid region and secondly places where uh, you have heavy monsoon and heavy rainfalls. We cover both these questions so watch this video till the end. Dr. Robert O'Nathan was the former extension officer at the extension service of the Israeli Agriculture Ministry. He has expertise in avocado and he has consulted and still consults large avocado orchards in uh, South America and Israel as well. He has worked together with Dr. Benyakov. Uh, Dr. Benyakov was the father of the Israeli avocado industry and they have worked together on uh, rootstocks, West Indian rootstocks from the Israeli selection. So he's the best person to ask questions about rootstocks. If you have any questions for him or for me, post it in the comment section down below and I'll ask Dr. Roberto Nathan those questions and create a separate video about it that will clarify your doubts and benefit the community. Okay, so we have covered a bit of it here, but what are the most suitable avocado rootstocks for arid and semi-arid regions? Well, if the soil yeah. usually in those areas is uh, with high alkaline, with high yeah. lime content yeah. uh, and maybe salinity problems, first of all, use West Indian roots. Yeah. Uh, you can adjust every rootstock to the specific conditions because every variety inside the Western Indian rootstock, we have a number of varieties yes. uh, adjust to very specific conditions. Okay. So with what we usually do is we ask the grower yeah. to run a full soil analysis, okay. water analysis. Yeah. Remember we talked about the water source hmm. and then we adjust the proper rootstock for every condition. There are cases that we hesitate, maybe this one or the other one. So we try both or three or four, but no more than that. And uh, of course, every variety has a specific characteristics for every soil and water and conditions. But those are the varieties I would recommend. So okay. can you tell me a bit more about uh, uh, what rootstocks are the most suitable for monsoon season or like where they have heavy rainfalls? I, I understand. I was in India by <laughs> the monsoon. I know it's heavy rain, <laughs> yeah. but uh, heavy rain results in um, flood and all that. So if the soil orchard becomes flat for uh, a lot of time, for a long period of time, the trees will be affected. No question about it. The strongest rootstock that can withstand that condition is fir tree. No question about it. But even fir tree, if this situation continues, if you see water, on the soil for a long time, yeah. even furniture will not survive. If you have a good uh, aeration and water percolates properly, there will not be a consequence. So, so if you build raised beds, or you call them uh, uh, what do you call it? ridges or raised beds, then does that help? If you have clay soil, yeah. you should build high beds if, and build them in a way yeah. that water will drain out of the field. So if you know that you are in an area, area of danger, let's call it, yeah. you should build the rows in a way, first of all, high beds, and yeah. second, so water use a natural slope or whatever to yeah. for, to get rid of the uh, water. 
That's that's critical because avocado uh, roots is very sensitive to excess of water or lack of oxygen. I hope you found this video interesting and uh, thank you for watching. That's it for this video. Don't forget to hit subscribe and push the notification icon. Bye-bye.